today's collectible spot, we're having a look at the LEGO DC Universe superheroes. We're looking today at set 6858, the Catwoman Cat Cycle City Chase. Of the set, which is by the way 89 pieces of the set, you can see it includes Batman with a glider, Catwoman with a cat cycle, and what also looks to be a very crudely built traffic light. I would be a little concerned with traffic lights that could come off that easily. A good gush of wind, that light would be falling on your car. You can also see that Catwoman has made off with a diamond. This is for ages 15 to 12. Up at the top we got a picture of Batman. He's about to throw his batarang at God knows what. Who knows. Speaking of which though, on the side there's a picture of the actual size. This size right here, fellas and ladies. That's the actual size of this Batman Lego minifigure. That size. On the back, we get a picture of the completed set. I would imagine it's not going to take spot very long to put this set together. But as you can see, we have the Cat Cycle Batman. And then many different articles, accessories, some crates from the looks of it, and some newspapers. Read all about it. Spot's about to get this built for you guys. I thought that said Bazinga, it just says Fuzzing. I don't even think that's a natural sound that a Batarang should make, but apparently LEGO does. You can also go to www.lego.com for all your LEGO news and information, including these sets right here that Spot is tapping the box to. Speaking of box, what I am going to do is take about a minifigure size break. It's about this big. I'm going to take a bit of a break. I'm going to get this put together. It won't take very long. And when I come back, we are going to get a better look at set 6858, the Catwoman Cat Cycle City Chase. Stay tuned, guys. There's definitely more on the way. And the build time for this set is probably only about five minutes or so, five, ten minutes. It depends on how distracted you were. By the way, if you hear a noise in the background, I think somebody is moving. I unfortunately, I can't control it. I've already asked them, you know, to change their move to a different day because I was doing reviews, but, well, I can't control stuff like that. Um, the set, before we actually look at the main set, we'll look at the minifigures that come with the set. First of all, we've got ourselves Batman. This would be the same also Batman, if anyone was wondering, as the Batman that came with the Batcave set. The only difference is this Batman does come with a bat glider. Uh, the face would be the same. You get yourself a serious Batman. We flip it around, we get a more angry. Either that or he has to take a crap, I don't know. I like the fact that they went with the blue and gray as opposed to just all black. You'll also see that Batman does come with a Batarang. I've got him currently holding it. If I could make one, hey, I'm trying to review here. They don't care. They really don't care. The Batarangs are a little longer than I would have preferred, but in order for the Lego to properly hold the Batarang, it unfortunately is something you just kind of have to deal with. On the back of the glider, you can see that uh, there's all this extra, here, I'll take it off. You can see that you can put on a thruster, kind of a thruster backpack. It's part of the glider. Now you. You could, leave the, you could leave it off if you want, and you can kind of have just Batman pretending like he's swinging in. Uh, he won't fly anywhere, though, with, without it, so we'll just plug that into place. It's a little gaudy, I think, to have all this on the back, but, you know, with it being Lego, you could probably just, you know, you could retool it. You could just make something a little smaller if you prefer. But that there is Batman. The other minifigure that comes with this set is Catwoman. Catwoman is, uh, I guess, featured in her more recent modern costume. You can also see that she's got all white eyes. And she's smiling there. You can take the helmet off, or her mask off, and you can flip it around if you went, if you wish, and you can have her with her normal eyes. For me, it's a toss-up. I really don't know which I prefer. I kind of like the white eyes, but I also really like just the regular f eyes as well. 
As Bob Ross would say, in your own world, you can do whatever you want. As for spot, spot's still undecided. I don't really know which I'm going to use yet. But I like the costume. I like the, the mask quite a bit. And by the way, for anyone new to Lego, the articulation would be a standard swivel in the head. Yes, standard swiveled arms. You swivel at the wrists, and you can bend the legs. Uh, but those are the two minifigures that make up this set. Um, of the things that actually make up the, the actual build pieces, you got yourselves crates. Different box crates, I guess. You can take the lids off if you want. It's not very big, so you probably can't hold very much in it. But I mean, if you have, uh, you know, maybe some of the bank money from the, the Two Face set, maybe if you had some gold coins or something like that from the pirate set, you could probably put them in there if you want. But you get two full size crates that actually can hold something. And then you've also got these smaller crates that basically are just the building blocks with the flat pieces on top. There isn't really a set, or there really isn't an area on the display piece, or the, the actual build piece, where you could put these crates. So I guess just really if you wanted to, you could stack them on the sides. Just kind of like that. Just kind of like that. Catwoman also does come with a, well, the set also comes with a cycle for Catwoman. On camera, it kind of looks like it's more of a blue-purple, but in, in person, it's actually more like a violet. There's sections on the sides. There's a clip on that side and on that side that can hold her whip. I'll just take her whip. I'll show you guys what it looks like in her hand. Like so. It's, uh, it's pliable, like it's a rubber, like a rubbery plastic, so it has a little bit of give to it. I would have really liked if that if this set had come with like a little tiny Lego cat. You maybe could have some more put I don't know where, but maybe you could have just had the cat sitting on the side of her bike. You can take Catwoman though and slide her into her bike. She also has these little kickstands you can bring in, or you can uh, extend out if you want her, want the bike to be able to stand a little bit better. I have to tweak it. There you go. Uh, but I like the bike. I, I think the bike is really, really neat. Pretty easy to build, too. I mean, the, like this whole purple area is just a shell, and then you just cl clip it into the lower end of the bike where you just would attach the wheels and you attach the, uh, the, the stands, the leg stands. There you have Catwoman with her bike. Move her aside, and then finally... The other piece that you get in this set, I guess the main piece really, is you get yourself a traffic light with a removable top piece to the light. I don't know why they didn't uh, finish off the back. It's finished from all sides except for the back, and the back doesn't have anything to do with how it hangs. I'm kind of surprised that they didn't give it. I guess really if you can't, if you can a, you collect Lego, you probably have several of these. You could probably make that that fourth piece. Pretty sure unless Spot's missing that piece, you guys will have to let me know down, down below. Maybe I didn't get that piece in my set. Maybe I, maybe I am missing it. Uh, but it does hang. It hangs pretty good. I mean, it's not going to fall off. Other things that are in this set. Got yourself a little mailbox. A little tiny mailbox. It actually is uh, is a, a built Lego piece. You can see there's a lower brick. There's a couple of pieces there. It's not just a you know, boom. There you got a mailbox. You actually have to you have to put a little work into it. You kind of got like a uh, curb side going on there. There's a little slot there that holds these little tiny Lego news. What's the Lego news today, Spot? Let's zoom in. Let's see if I can actually see this. Get get in camera. The greatest Lego hero ever. Ah, uh, really? It's so nice, Lego. I could probably make that out. I don't think the camera's going to be able to get it, though. Hmm. All I get is the Lego news. Something, something, something. 
dark side something. No, it doesn't say dark side. But there is actually text there. You could try to read it if you want. I'm not going to. Volume 3, though. You also get yourself Volume 3. They didn't even try. Is it me? That guy kind of looks like, from a distance, Bob Ross. I think I just got Bob Ross stuck in the brain. But you can take the, the newspapers, just put it in the slot here. Little slot news. I guess they must be free papers. You just come along and take whatever you want. Kind of like those bowls of candy at Halloween. They, they always say, just take one. But you know every child just gonna, is going to take all of them. That's what kids are like. Not all of them, some kids. Uh, but a pretty good set. I mean, it's it, it's a fairly inexpensive set. The set itself is only going to cost you anywhere from, you know, 7 to $10, depending on where you find it. Uh, I think the Lego minifigures are pretty cool. You get yourself Batman, and you get yourself Catwoman. You probably have been collecting all the other sets, so you might have several Batmans. But I would say the set is probably worth getting solely for getting the Catwoman here. Again, Spot's still uncertain as to how which face he wants to use. I might just use the human, you know, the, the normal eyes as opposed to the white eyes. But again, it's up to you. There you go, guys. Today's collectible spot, we were having a look at set 6858 from the LEGO DC Universe series. And this was the Catwoman Cat Cycle City Chase. Not too bad. Not too bad. Thanks for watching, as you always do, guys. Be sure to stick around. There is certainly more LEGO reviews to come. And I will see you guys next time. <laughs>